Hello and welcome to the Substance for Unity 5 tutorial. In this series, we're going to take a look at creating PBR textures for character and environment assets using Substance Designer and Substance Painter. This series will cover in depth how to utilize Substance materials and textures with Unity's PBR shader. The course is designed for intermediate users of Substance Designer, Substance Painter, and Unity and is divided into three chapters. In Chapter 1, we discuss PBR fundamentals such as understanding PBR, working with the PBR shaders in Unity 5, as well as using and optimizing substance materials. In Chapter 2, we will dive into Substance Designer to create a tileable rocky ground material. We will create a modular material that is driven by user parameters. This will allow us to apply variations to the material directly in Unity. By making the material modular, we will be able to use it to texture the ground, rocks, and cliffs by simply tweaking a few sliders. This chapter will also cover how the environment models were created. Finally, in Chapter 3, I will demonstrate how to use Substance Painter to texture a character and export the maps for use with the Unity 5 standard shader. Dividing the course into these chapters allows you to choose which topics interest you the most. Each chapter can be viewed on its own or as a complete series. If you are new to PBR, then you'll want to start with Chapter 1. If you are only interested in characters or painting non-tileable prop assets, then Chapter 3 has what you're looking for. At the end of this series, you will have a complete understanding of the Substance workflow and how its native integration with Unity provides the best solution for creating PBR textures for your Unity 5 projects.